Hey y'all, welcome back to Mrs. Lynn's Cooking. Today we're going to make no fried chicken fried chicken. All we're going to need is panko. I use Everglades, you say seasoning you want with a little bit of oregano. One egg. I'm only doing two chicken breasts. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is take some panko and just put it in a plate. Um, it depends on how many chicken breasts you're doing and we're not doing a whole bunch. So we're going to take our Everglades seasoning and I'm going to put about uh, cool, about two tablespoons of my Everglades in here. Because you want to make sure your flavors come through. So we're going to do that. Then we're going to take a little bit of oregano and we're going to put that in. And then we're just going to take our hands, kind of mix it together. And what you'll do is take your chicken breasts, make sure that you rinse them off before you do this because you want them nice and clean. So the first thing we do is we take our chicken breasts that's been rinsed. We're going to put it in an egg wash. Whoops, about wore it. There we go. And then from there, I'm going to let it drip a little bit and then I'm going to put my panko over it to where we have plenty of panko on it. And it's best just to put it on top, flip it over, mash it down. That way it stays on your piece of meat. So, and you can do this with chicken or cube steak, any of it. We use the same recipe. And then we take it out of here and then we're going to put it on our baking sheet that I have non-stick baking sheet, but if you don't, make sure you spray it with some oil, okay? We're gonna do the same with this little chicken breast that we beat the egg first. And like I said, we'll just press it down in there and then we're just gonna pile up our panko on top of it. And this takes a few minutes to do which is fine because you want to make sure it's nice and crispy. And you see how we've done that? And then go ahead and just double panko it up. That's what I'm doing. But if you don't have the egg wash, it really is not going to stick. So you really need to do an egg wash first. And then we're going to take our chicken breast, put it in our pan. And then after we put it in our pan, we are going to put it in our air fryer for, you're going to keep an eye on it, but I'm going to say about 20 minutes for two small chicken breasts. Okay, we have cooked our chicken, fried chicken, at 400 for 19 minutes in an air fryer, and they're nice and crispy. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. 